look at that. No, I don't want to. I don't want to save. I just wanted to show off that cool light blade. And welcome back, everybody. I'm the Outlier. We are playing Prince of Persia: Warrior Within. Hopefully, I won't suck at this part, but there's no guarantees. Like I said, no guarantees. No, not. Oh gosh. You know, just starting the video off with failures of epic proportions. Uh, I, you know, I, I got so excited about showing the blade, I forgot. You gotta do this. I'm so glad that the prince can shove his body in small A clothes as soon as he's falling down a flat surface. That's actually a very handy trick. Most people can't do that. Yep. And then, this is one, run and jump. Got it. But if you didn't get the, um, if you just so happen to miss some of the um, nine upgrade pedestals. Assist me. I'm not even going to kill you with the water blade. Who said that? Who was bold enough to speak? Where am I? Oh, this is where I fought the thrall in the beginning. Okay, so that's sealed off. I don't need to go that way. I just need to go this way. Yeah, ho! Okay. Yeah. yeah. Really? You're gonna sit, kick, flip yourself off? Uh oh. Off the side, really? Pr oh, hey. This one that I got you before, but. Alright. So I guess that door should be open now. Oh. What do you want from me? My other self still works to activate the towers. There's ample time to return to the throne room and await the opening of the door. Oh, that's why that was broken. Got it. The towers, I... He has activated them. Am I too late? I have come too far to fail. Huh. Well, I mean... Wait, what just happened? Did the light blade instantly obliterate one of my enemies without me realizing it? I think it did. I don't know. I have two of the greatest blades in the game. Uh, you'll have to pardon me if I'm giddy. It's like, uh... It's awesome. Technically, all these should already be, yeah, pulled down. Because my past self should have just did it. Should be like, it should be like, no issues, bruh. No issues, bro. So, okay. And face this way and jump. Ha ha. Ha ha. Okay. Make it past all the way past there. And I gotta get back to that door. Okay. Oh, thank goodness they're not out. Come on. And drop. Booby. Attacker! Ah, nice. See, if you miss the water blade, or yeah, if you miss the water blade, the light blade is like the next best thing. Not as strong as a water blade, um, but definitely, definitely something that is worth keeping your eye out for. The fact that it doesn't break makes it a really, really good permanent addition to your weapons. Uh, like I said before, I, I didn't really go for any of the other um, bladed or, or any of the other secret weapons because. I think some of them break in, they have such differing uh, qualities that it wasn't really worth me picking up. I did pick up all of them when I first played through this game, um, but I just, excuse me, found it more useful to have uh, that second hand free for grappling abilities. Like grappling abilities become invaluable, hey, invaluable. 
especially when you're going through some of the more tense sections um, where it's like yep yep Re hey I'm so glad they don't have like spikes that jut out of those holes I think maybe they were designing some traps to be like that and then they're like nah this section we're actually we're good on traps here huh 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 Ugh. Yep, still got hit. Oh, well, I ended up up here. Holy crap. Come on. Ah! Nice. Ha! He fell in a straight line. Alright, so I have to make it to that side and make it down back over. So I can drop down. And, oh my gosh. Okay. Trying to have a tense moment for no reason. Uh, oh, okay. I gotta go up here, I think. Nope. That's it, Prince. Thank you. Uh he worries me sometimes. It's like like you guys saw last episode where he glitched. Was it last episode or was it a couple episodes ago? I can't remember. Where he just so obviously glitched and was in the same step pattern because some invisible edge caught his big toe. It's like, uh, no, I don't want that to happen. Not when I've come so far. Made so much progress. Oh, okay. But, oh, I love my light blade. Ha! Love it to bits. Oh. And you know, I gotta admit, the sound in this game is actually pretty darn good, too. And they make sure that when things are going on, they are almost right near here. Intense. Alright. Now, friends, I'm gonna tell you right now. There is... I don't think it's a thrall, but it's one of those things that's coming up. Got a helmet. We don't have time to stop and smell the roses and try to fight it, alright? We just gotta run... Because we gotta stop our past self from playing so good that he reaches this point. Because you remember what happened. We uh, we said better you than me. I already heard him. I already heard him, big bastard. He said better you than me when the last one of us got eaten. Prince, just just run, dude. Just hop, 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 turn. Uh, just run. Nope. Oh, you got you got stuck. That's okay. And we have, yay! Good job, Prince. I'm telling you, I'm liking the sand rate for you more and more. You actually have that that a bit my tongue. Oh. Nope. Maybe I'll just quit while I'm ahead. Good job. Oh. Bit my tongue ever so slightly. Aha! Kids with one sword. Kids with the other. Kids with the other. It's so strong. I love it. Though for some parts, I do really kind of wish that there was a sprint faster button that the prince had. Just to make some, just to expedite some parts. Because even though the backtracking is nice and it takes you through the nice environment, you know, at this point, you're kind of like, oh, man, you know, we got we to gotta go fast. We got to catch up. And it's like, mm. And it, it almost diminishes your sense of urgency at this point. Because we got to go fast. But the prince can only go so fast. So we're relying on the prince's foot speed. Just avoid it all together. And down. Hup. All right. So there we go. All 
All right. I thought as much. Prince, no need to fear. Prince is here. I see the swinging blades. Yep. Tell me I'm not too late. All this happening is before. No, I must not let him pass. Nice! I'm sorry. The mask, it's loose. Sweet. Stomp on it. I'm back. <laughs> With this same bewildered expression. There's the mask. Can't pick it up though. That's okay. Cause I still got look, my help, it's not going down anymore. And I still got my sick blades, bruh. Alright. Now to the throne room. You may not remember me, but I tried to kill you before. No hard feelings, right? I'm gonna kill you again. We'll kill you again. Race to the throne. So Let's go and get away with double homicide. Double homicide? Double murder? I don't know. Double vision. Up oh, and up. Oh, up, oh, Prince. We don't have unlimited sand tanks, buddy. So we uh, got to make sure that we're not uh, screwing things up. It would help if we did not do that. The cool sand wraith powers are gone, unfortunately. That thing was cool, though. I must admit. Right. I keep forgetting that there is that before the throne room. <laughs> okay. Alright. Alright. Alright, so... Up. Up. Slow. Down. Yeah. We're using our sand wisely. Probably should have left it for this part. Oh, up, oh. mm. da, 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 ha, ah. made it. All right. Yeah. Awesome. All right. So we don't even need to use anything for this. It's gonna be run. Yeah, we're here. Stammer. You ready? I've been thinking, Kylina. There is little for you on this island, and there will be less still once I've stood before your mistress. Come with me to Babylon. You'll have a chance to begin a new life, free from the evils of this place. I'm sorry, Prince, but I cannot take you up on your offer. Why? Oh yeah, he knows. Your murder's coming. Prince, we have the water blade. You could have just stabbed her in the neck right there. You felt her, or better yet, when she was walking away, sauntering away, you could have easily jumped on her, stabbed her in the back. All of these things would have taken care of whatever you need to take care of at that time. But okay, let's see. Let's make sure that I am fully prepared for what's to come. Are there any other pots that I can break down here that may give me another sand tank? Uh, of course not. Because that's just oh so wonderful. All right. You know, Kalina, we've done this dance before. Here we go. Pull the lever and be done with it. This is what I would have said. Oh, Breaker Throne. It doesn't have to end this way. Come with me. 
into the present. So you can kill me in your own time instead of mine? <laughs> I'm sorry, Prince, but only one of us can cheat fate today. Yeah. Boom, baby. Kalina, Empress, listen. I don't want no, to kill you. You listen. The timeline has said you will kill me, but I will change the timeline. I don't want to kill you. Nice. That's right. That's just what you get. Uh, time to take a sip and save. Just in case things go south. And apparently, it's like finale video, I think. I think. I, I don't know. I, who knows how this crazy, wacky story between these two crazy kids is going to end. Huh? Huh? The Dahaka? Does he know? Probably. Pervert. Now, see how decrepit things have become. Didn't she only exist in the past? I don't think Kylie was ever part of the present. And now that she's stuck here and there's no sand to, you know, take her back. It's kind of like, oh, Bullocks. Bullocks and biscuits, cause she, she's taken off. She is not here anymore. Ha. Huh. Oh boy. But at least, you know, finally it's like, let me try and reason with her. Hotness, come with me. Come with me if you want to live in Babylon with me, cause you're hot. But again, Prince, She's a sand creature. She hasn't been anything but a sand. Oh, the time thing uh, replenished my uh, sand tanks. Thank you. Bunches. I love that. Ah, sick flip. I know what you've seen. What you think you've seen in the timeline. Then you know I have no choice. There is always a choice, Kylina. Then I choose to live. And for you to die. Stand down! I do not want to kill you! Even if you don't want to kill me, you will. The timeline demands it. No, Kylina. You can change your fate. I have done so. A terrible beast was destined to take my life, but I have freed myself from... What is that No! Thing? How is this possible? I have stopped Kylina from dying in the past. There are no sands in the hourglass. Nice. Kylina, who does not belong in this timeline. The beast is after her now. In bringing her here, I have sentenced her to death. This is all your fault! Yeah! Could this be? This sword, it seems to protect me from the Dahaka. Perhaps the beast is not so invincible after all. Damn Skippy. Come here. Where to go? Come here. doing I need to wear on you don't you run from me don't you run from me don't you run from me
I don't care, Dahaka. Boom, baby. Aw. Didn't do much. Kylina, any help that you give at this point would be much appreciated. Okay, there we go. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it, baby. Bonnie and Clyde. Oh. Kylina, I, I could use your help. Oh, gosh. He is. D oh, how did he heal himself? How did he heal himself? Kylina. Baby girl, I could. You could. I need some water. Something. Okay. Well, that didn't go as smoothly as I thought it could. That's okay, that's okay, that's okay. We're gonna try this again. See, I told you. It's like, oh, I'm so... What happened to my light blade? No! Are you here? No, oh well. Light blade wouldn't have done me any good. That's okay. You all saw the cutscene with the light blade. Stand up. Even in trying to strike her, uh, the Dahaka with the light blade, it wouldn't have done much. Like, see? Like, now is one of the very few times where I can actually, like, hit the Dahaka. Now is one of the few times where, like, a regular strike can hit the Dahaka and, like, do something. See? He changed his attack. He changed it mid-attack. And that's bull. That's bull crap. Because he was gonna uh, put the tendrils down. There you go. Like, nah, bullshit. I'm calling bullshit. Alright, now let's beat on his head. Yeah, I'm trying to get him really low. But then again, I want to save my sand tanks because in the next part of the battle... Maybe, maybe I'm holding out hope. Maybe I can finish him here. I hope I can. Oh, come on. Come on. Don't go down yet. Come on. I got one more sand tank left. Come on. Be done here. Be done here. Yes! Son of a bitch! his only weakness. Oh.
Well then, that was the epic conclusion of the Prince of Persia, the Warrior Within. So I guess while he was enraptured in the passion that he and, um, of course I'm going to say the end, but while he was enraptured in the passion that he and Kylina were enjoying on the boat because high stress events can lead to a strong romantic feel initially, but it usually doesn't pan out because you build a bond. While that, um, uh, while, you know, the situation is what it is, I'm going to take the time to talk now because the music is not playing. And I won't get copywritten strict um, at this point, which is nice. But just to say a few words before we move on, um, it looks like um, this ending was the canon to, uh, was canon to the story. So essentially, if you went without getting all of the, uh, health upgrades then you got the bad ending which was he would go he would fight Kylina he would kill her um, and he would leave the island by himself uh, still on the boat like he was but it would just, he would just be like a miserable wretch and all this other kind of stuff he would have avoided the Haka he'd go back to his own time and everything would be unky dory um, but since you did this ending, that leads into uh, the Prince of Persia Two Thrones, where there's this dark entity, and it looked like the Dark Prince, uh, or a dark version of the Prince. You saw Farah, or what looked like Farah from one in her red garb, um, held up on the stake, and Babylon was under siege. I can't remember, or embroiled in war, or something like that. It was burning. I can't remember. Um, where Farah said she was from in one, but uh, I would imagine that this is her home kingdom before the sands were taken. I mean, we defeated the vizier in one, so I'm not sure, but the prince ended up sleeping, I would imagine, with the Empress of Time, so he slept with the sand creature, so he can notch that off his bucket list, but man... This game was fantastic. I absolutely love it. This was my favorite game of uh, the Prince of Persia series overall. It had a darker, grittier tone to it. Uh, the gameplay was really good. The physics of the gameplay was really good. I like that you had more options uh, in that you can dual wield weapons. Um, you had more options as far as takedowns, and wall runs, and using your environment to your advantage as you were engaging in combat. The storyline was really cool. Um, I liked the fact, even though it got a little tedious every now and then, I liked the fact you had to backtrack because most of the time when you did, uh, they gave you at least a, a little bit of a new tidbit that told a little bit more of the story, told another part of the story. Uh, the graphic design was great. The 3D rendering was great. Now, everybody needs to remember this is a PlayStation 2 era game so um i think they did extremely well um like i was saying ubisoft phenomenal job and everybody you know i just want to point out that prince of persia came before assassin's creed so all the physics that you're seeing in prince of persia 
or all this, all the physics and the gameplay that you were seeing with uh, climbable environments, acrobatics, wall running, um, those were kind of set up by the Prince of Persia series. Ubisoft did this first, so um, I thought that that was a really cool cor uh, correlation to make in that they really expanded on the idea of kind of like parkour-esque free-range combat where you're using everything at your disposal, picking up other enemies' weapons. That was a very cool factor in it as well. Um, and doing what you can to survive. Getting in, getting out. and oh, Great game, great game, great experience. Glad I was able to beat the Dahaka. I'm glad I was able to show you where all nine of the life upgrades were. Glad I was able to show you where the light sword was. Even though the game took it from me after I had died that first time. Um, but very, 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 very cool. Very cool gaming experience. So, oh, if you like the video, mash that like button like there's no tomorrow and share the video with the world. Hit me up on Facebook. Hit me up on Twitter. Hit me up in the comments section below. Let me know what you think of the game. I am the outlier. Check out all my other games that I did in the past. I played Prince of Persia in the past. I played Whiplash. I'm um, playing Outland now, so Outland is the next thing to get finished up before I continue with all the new content. Thank you so much for sticking with me, and, and thank you so much for your support. I love you all, and I'm so happy to be doing this for all of you, and I will see you all in the next video.